Start with the family of a boy hit and killed by a runaway dump truck while playing at his home in Hillsborough. The family is now suing the construction companies working in the area. Everett Copeland was playing in his yard with three other kids the day after Christmas when the truck rolled down a steep hill, hitting Copeland and, and crashing into his home. Detectives determined 20-year-old Alejandro Suarez did not properly set the parking brake. It was also discovered Suarez did not have a license or experience operating the truck. CBS North Carolina's A.J. Janivel just got his hand on the lawsuit and he joins us from the Orange County Courthouse with more AJ. Hey Sharon, hey Sean, I just spoke with the Copeland family attorney and they said that they filed that motion today in civil court against several different parties involved. As you mentioned earlier, the driver of the truck, the contractor, the construction company, as well as other parties involved. But something interesting that you guys just mentioned is Alejandro Suarez, who was charged with criminal misdemeanor death by motor vehicle, is also being charged in this civil case. But the attorney tells me they're trying to speak with him earlier, get an earlier expedited disposition because that attorney tells me they are worried that Suarez may be deported. As I mentioned, he is facing those criminal charges. He's also facing deportation from the feds. And what the Copeland family attorney tells me is he is a key witness in this terrible incident, and they want the chance to speak with him. The family also put out a statement today. They say that their young five-year-old son is missed not only by his twin sister and, and other family members, but the entire community. Reporting live here in Orange County, I'm A.J. Janivel for CBS North Carolina.